Welcome to the top 5 Jedi Survivor mods of the week, episode 6. I've got 5 cool mods to share with you this week, but before we do take a look at them, make sure you do subscribe to this channel so you won't miss any future episodes in this series. Kicking off the top 5 countdown in 5th place this week is the General Anakin Skywalker mod from Luke Spain. So this mod introduces Anakin's general appearance from the Clone Wars into Jedi Survivor, and it requires the Outfit Manager mod to work. Unfortunately, you can't mix and match this outfit or change the colours of any of it using the Outfit Manager mod. In fourth place this week, we have the Anakin Revenge of the Sith Robes mod from Light M1. So this mod introduces another appearance for Anakin into Jedi Survivor, this time his robes from Revenge of the Sith. Unlike the mod that I showed you in a previous episode, this is not just his tunic, but also comes with his actual robes, which is an individual option in Outfit Manager, so you're able to either have the robes on or off, it's up to you. In third place this week, we have another mod from Knight M1, and this is the Arkhan mod. So this introduces the character from Star Wars The Old Republic into Jedi Survivor. As you can see, it makes use of the Outfit Manager mod, so you can pick and choose which parts of this outfit you want to use in the game. For example, you can have his mask on or off and replace his head with cows, so, so you don't need Arkhan's head, you can actually use cows if you want to. It's up to you what variation you use in this game and I think that's great. The runner-up for this top 5 mods of the week episode is the Cow Voice Changer mod from ABD Ashes and Killer Calf. So this mod introduces a variety of different voices to choose from to replace Cow's voice in the game. Here is what is included, so there is the masked Cow voice, which deepens and distorts Cow's voice, giving him an impression of wearing a mask such as Kylo Ren's. There is a secondary masked Cow voice, and this is more in line with Battlefront 2's Kylo Ren. There is an even deeper masked Cow voice, then a muted Cow voice, and then there is a B1 Bastroid Cow voice mod, to make him sound like a B1 droid. There is a Stormtrooper or Mandalorian cow voice, as well as a more subtle Stormtrooper voice. And on top of that, an older or Inquisitor cow voice. I will now let you hear a few voice lines from some of the voice packs included. Got a second, Monk? For now, you're gonna be all right. One moment. Grease, you should know. When my old crew worked from Mantis, we made a few changes. Hey, Mark. Good to see you, Cal. Till next time, pal. Depends. What are we talking about? I heard there's a whole shipload. One moment. Not that I've seen. Oh, thank goodness. Thought it was... Oh, hold on. <laughs> I haven't used these since the scrapyard on Braca. Prof gave them to me. Cordova was a gentle soul. Can't say I have, but am I missing? I'll look into it. Thanks for the tip. And the winner of this top 5 Mods of the Week episode is the Modular Clone Armor mod from Sanuku and Knight M1. So this mod introduces the Clone Trooper armor for Cal into Jedi Survivor. And not only are you able to choose the individual parts, so you don't have to wear the helmet, you can if you want, you can mix and match it with other outfits, but you're also able to choose from 9 different variations on the armor, so you can have a 501st trooper, or a 212th, or a shot trooper, and even a few others as well, so it's just really really cool. You can make your own custom clone trooper, you don't just have to have the correct colour scheme for each part, you can just do whatever you want. You can have a 327th helmet, a 212th attack battalion torso piece, and 501st arms and legs. It's up to you. This is the most expansive outfit manager mod yet, and I know people have been waiting to use clone armor, and this is just a level above that what you'd expect. Which mods were your favourites this week? Let me know down in the comment section below. Remember, you can check out each of them for yourself using the download links in the description. If you did have a standout mod for this week, be sure to vote in the community tab poll, and I will reveal the results at the end of next week's episode. But now let's take a look at the results of the poll from last week's episode, which just over which just over 2,000 of you voted in, and the winner with 60% was the Skywalker Twins, and the winner with 60% was the Skywalker Twins lightsabers. 
followed by the Kylo Ren mod with 19%, Luke got 12% and Leon got 8 If you enjoyed this video please do drop a like, subscribe so you don't miss any future Jedi Survivor videos and if you did miss any of my previous videos do click on the playlist on the screen right now and I shall see you in my next video. Goodbye.